Hello everybody, it's Joe here and welcome back to another episode of Transport Fever 2. You're joining our coal train. Oh, look at that, hang on. Look at that, you can just see the other one going across the uh, the bridge in the distance there. Isn't that pretty? Uh, that wasn't actually meant to happen, but it's quite pretty nonetheless. You, you might need to get a magnifying glass out, but I promise you there's a train there. Look, there we go. Going across the bridge. Uh, yeah, we're just on our way into Faircomb uh, Goods uh, Hub call it Faircoom Goods Hub and uh, with our first coal delivery so hopefully this should see the start of a cheeky little bit of steel production. I mean what have we got there? We've got plenty of iron ore waiting uh, ready to be used. I reckon we're gonna need more coal trains on this you know purely and simply because uh, I mean this can carry 286 and if we have a look yeah there's, there's a lot more than 286 waiting there so I reckon we need at least two more uh, goods trains freight trains on this route. Now uh, what we're going to be go doing today is uh, is we're going to be expanding our main line because it's been brought to my attention that we don't have the capacity unfortunately to be running all these freights and the express passenger trains. Things are starting to clog up which is not what you want. Uh, not what you want in the slightest. Look at him just snaking in isn't that absolutely beautiful. I'm so glad that we decided to do this freight, you know, normally I, well, I mean, I've, I've been doing freight quite a bit in this series, uh, normally I stay clear of freight and just focus on passenger, uh, but I really am enjoying doing the freight on this. There we go, ping, let's get some steel production please, 36.5 million in the bank doing that, that's absolutely lovely, and uh, steel is being produced, that is what we want. I mean, where's our local steel train? Oh, the, uh, the the track situation seems to have righted itself. I mean, in the last episode, the land appeared to have grown over the track. I'm not quite sure how that happened, but alas, it did happen. Where are you then, Sonny Jim? Oh, look at that. I mean, there's some absolutely gorgeous screenshots around here, isn't there? How many can you carry? 105 steels. Brilliant. Oh, there's 10 steel waiting. Oh, I'm so excited. It's really, really good to actually start producing some steel. And steel costs a lot of money. Oh no, steel will bring in a lot of money. Uh, so, yeah, here we go. Uh, this is what we're up against here. This section of track is just too congested. I mean, I, I say it's too congested. It's not too congested in the slightest, but... But freight train, freight train, HST. So I thought, so the HSTs... Ooh, a full HST, that's what we like. So the HSTs can come to oh look, another freight train. So they can continue running at capacity. We need to really do something about the amount of tracks. I reckon four track will be absolutely fine down here. I reckon. Of course it will. Why wouldn't it be fine? Uh, so what we are going to do, and I don't know if this would be the best way of doing it, but hear me out. We're going to improve uh, the speed of this train over here. Now the freight's maximum speed on this line is going to be 75. So let's drag you out to there, please. Yeah, lovely. And we're going to get rid of this signal. Yeah, there we go. Get rid of that signal. And can we move you to... Oh, hang on. What's happened to my signals? Oh, there we go. Have I subscribed to something new? Maybe I have. I've literally completely lost track of the mods that I have for this. I really do keep meaning to get around to making a mod list for uh, for you guys. And uh, and I keep forgetting because I'm useless. There we go. Can we keep you... Oh, you're 40 out of here. Right, okay. Well, we'll just have you at 40 then. I, I was hoping for... No, do you know what? Actually, we'll upgrade it. We will absolutely upgrade it. 70. Oh, hang on. I don't want you to be 70 all the way around. You can... You can go back down to 40. Hang on, what, what's the line speed here? 50. Right, oh, you're, you're 50, right. Why is the inside 40? Goodness only knows. I, I'm struggling to recall why I built it like that, but I did. There we go. What speed are you at the other side? 30. Ooh. Well, I'm not sure I like that. Let's get you upgraded straight to 75. Oh, hang on. Oh, dear. Oh, we, we've had a strop. Waiting for free path. Oh, my lord, there's going to be a collision. Right, stop, 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 stop. 
Good lord. Right, can you go please? Oh my lord, my life flashed before my eyes. I mean, there are no collisions on Transport Fever 2. He would have just gone sailing straight through. But still, oh, we couldn't have witnessed that, could we? And yet again, the freight train is let out in front of the passenger. So hopefully, what this will avoid, this is still going to be 30 mile an hour across. Yeah, there's nothing we can do about that. Well, there is. This is Transport Fever 2. You can do something about it. You can change it. I could do. But unfortunately, I'm not going to. There we go. You can set off again now, sir. And wait at this signal, please. There we go. Thank you very much. So yeah, 30 across there. There's no we can do about that. Oh, there's no we're going to do about that. Let's see if you're willing to accept 75 miles an hour. Because then, no, you're not. 55 works for me. There we go, 55. So this means that our freight trains now can carry an additional... Let's just... 75 you. Hang on. Oh, autosave. Yeah, that's that's speaking volumes there. I could really turn the autosave down so it autosaves less often, but the, the fact of the matter is, I mean, Transport Fever 2 with a hell of a lot of mods on does become somewhat unstable, so I think the autosave is definitely necessary at this point. There we go. Right, we'll just, we'll just pop you in there. So yeah, what this is going to do... Oh, hang on. That's fine. Uh, yeah, what this is going to do is it's going to make sure the trains going this way can keep up to 55 miles per hour. We're then going to have the speed limit going up to 75, because I know the speed limit of this isn't, but uh, there we go, we'll, we'll bring you up here. We'll just literally mirror this along the track that we've already got to make a nice four-track section. There we go. I know we're only building one line. There is a reason for this. Uh, oh, condition of multiple vehicles is poor. Yes, that's how we like it. I'm going to tunnel all the way around. Uh, not tunnel, tunnel through there. Bring you all the way around. What's happening with this then? That's going to throw a spanner in the works. Well, do you know what? That's all we're going to upgrade for the time being. We're doing a full British Rail uh, kind of half assed upgrade. Can we keep you at 75? Yep, we can keep you at 75. That's good. Right, signals. Get you both there. And we'll just signal down the uh, down the length of that line. There we go. And another. And you there. Put you in. And another one just before the bridge. I quite like this three-tracking business. Maybe we'll just three-track it. It'll be full on British Rail and uh, and not bother with the fourth track. Because I mean the the problem is this hill. This hill here is where it absolutely cripples us. But then again, it also cripples the HST. So you know. pop you on there. Lovely. I'm going to pop another signal there because I don't want things to get too backed up down this line. So there we go. Uh, what have we got now? Have we got things going through there? We have. Now what trains do we actually have coming through here? Uh, we've, we've got those freights coming out of here. Now I need to do something to get you. Ooh, now there's a thought. This is going to look absolutely somewhat interesting. There we go. Get rid of you. Now, can you tag on here? Yes, you can. Ah. Right, hang on. So we're going to tag you on there, bring you across. No, you have to stay with the bridge. You have to stay with the bridge, my, uh, my good friend. And we're going to bring you round. Now, why are you doing that? That doesn't look good. I mean, to be fair, it doesn't look awful. Does it? I mean, that. It's not ideal, but there's no. Nah, it'll do. We can live without it. There we go. We'll bring you round. Can we keep you at 50, please? There we go. Yeah, just stick with the lay of the land. 
I'm going to just bring you in there. What do you think to that? I don't think that's uh, that's too bad. Can we start you accelerating up to 75, please? What speed are we doing there? 75. What about you? I can't get 75 out of you because I could only just get 50. So then what we're going to do, so we don't have to junction across there, we'll delete you. Ah, look at that. Brilliant. We can delete that crossing. And then we can actually probably make this look a bit nicer. Don't know what the speed is down here. It's probably 50, isn't it? Right, there we go. We'll, we'll 50 you in. Much better. Ah, what an improvement. Uh, yeah, and this is going to look absolutely fantastic. Or words to that effect. There we go. We'll, we'll pop you in there. So that the freight will now go up the uh, the other freight line. Now, I have got more than just these. Uh, hang on. I, I need to see my freight. How, how do I just see? That's trucks. That's buses. This is trains. Uh, logs train. I didn't know I had logs trains. I do, but they don't come through here. Uh, so, what can we see? Uh, we can see the Abel Hannafin branch line. Faircoom coal train. Right, where are you? So, we need you between Tamvale and Faircoom to go down here, please. Oh, could not connect all stations. Oh, that's because this one. Hang on. Yeah, great muds and signal. Ah, yeah, okay, yeah. Uh, helps if you put... Well, for now, what we'll do... So we'll just put this across here. We will fix this, don't worry. There we go. There we go. Can you can you go down there now? Ooh, everyone's going down there. Except for the Transmap Regional. That is what we like. But hang on, where's the... Uh, Where's the other, the, the, the regional? Do I have a stopping service that goes down here? Who stops here? Nobody. Nobody stops at Faircoom. Ah, <gasps> we've forgotten Faircoom. Oh yeah, because we said we were going to go down to Chapel Coombe and then we just never did. Because we've got that, that station and the pretty bridge. Oh no, I can't believe we've been neglecting this town all this time. I mean, we've made some pretty infrastructure around this town, haven't we? So uh, they can get knotted. Right, there we go. So hopefully all the freight should now just... Oh, I mean, that one's... Yeah, that's going that way. That's what we expect. I mean, we could have some sort of dive under, couldn't we? No, you're, you're thinking a bit too extravagant now. Let's just get those basics right before we come up with anything else that's uh, weird and wacky. Now, what we also need to do... Uh, we need more coal. That's, that's the long and short of it. We need more coal production. Can we have another one of you? We can. What about two here? There we go. Four should be enough to keep the uh, to keep the old production going. Look at that. And then when that comes up out of here, that's going to look brilliant. Just bending round again, a big flyover. How much are you bringing in? 168 foodies. Oh, this is absolutely fantastic. Right, well, now that that's suitably upgraded, we need to work on uh, on this junction here, which is not at all satisfactory. I bet half of you thought I was going to leave that like that, but that's not the case. It's just a temporary measure, just a, just a temporary measure. Absolute temporary. Uh, so you're going to go under. At 60. Go on, 60. We can keep you at 60. I'm going to bend you there. You're not going to like that, are you? And what we'll do is we'll... There we go. Too steep. Okay. What about... What about from there? You're happy with that? Hmm. So there's nobody coming. Right, okay. Delete all that. It's a fast junction for freight, isn't it? But uh, I think it works. Right, we can get rid of you, because that's nonsense. And we'll bring you in a little bit faster. There we go. Lovely. That's nicer, isn't it? Uh, we'll pop a little signal. Just a, just a wee one. 
Want you there? Yeah, lovely. And another one there to show you around the tunnel. I think that's absolutely brilliant. Of course you do. You made it. Of course you think it's brilliant. Well, make sure you're nice and uh, you're nice and signalled along the front. Ah, fantastic. I want to see a train go on my new section of track. And ideally, I want to see it be overtaken by something fast. Ah, stun. Oh, now this is interesting. Oh, look at that. We're going to have a full-on race here. This is where the stone train wins, and it's somewhat embarrassing. Ooh, what are you saying? Train 74 has a problem. Oh, he's too long. It's too long for the station. Oh, heck. Oh, we're missing out on a train race here for this nonsense. Right, hang on. What do you think to that? Hang on, we'll have to come back to you. This is far too exciting. Hang on a second. Oh, they're both doing exactly 59 miles an hour, so it's literally who has the most power right now. I mean, the autosave is completely ruining the whole thing here. The whole spectacle. Let's get a... Oh, that's not going to work, is it? You... Yeah, your screenshot didn't work there. Brilliant. Oh, look at him go. Look at him go. He's slowly getting there. The HST is slowly pulling away. And of course, what we've not got to forget is when we get faster trains than the HST, such as the 800s, the 802s in the future, uh, then they're going to pull away a lot quicker and absolutely leave the freight. Now, the reason that we need this third line is obviously because this is a massive hill. Coming the other way, the freight will just be up to speed and it'll be empty. That's something we've also got to remember. And look at that, that's absolutely brilliant. I can barely hear myself think over the noise. All that clag that's coming out of that HST, that's absolutely fantastic. I mean, to be fair, the, the 47's doing good, we're up at 62 miles an hour. That's absolutely brilliant, I'm loving this. Absolutely loving it. We need to replace these with 67s and then they can uh, they can do 100. Oh, I'm, I'm really pleased with that. Really pleased. Right, now to sort out these flipping coal trains. Yeah, hang on, hang on. Right, I'm here. Oh no, don't clone them all. Flipping it, we nearly had a disaster there, didn't we? Right, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, right, you can carry not as much now. Hang on, now you can get there now. Because I can see that you can. Now there's there's a line. Can you can you move please? Oh for God's sake. Are you happy with that? Oh you'll move now. Oh good. I am pleased. Right, now that we've got rid of you, we could ideally do with some more, uh... I mean, how much is waiting here? Oh no, hang on, get off that bulldoze tool. Christ, that was a disaster nearly averted. Well, a disaster averted. Right, you're taking, you're coming in. Right, okay. Four might just be enough, then. How are we doing on the old iron ore front over here? Yep, yeah, loads waiting. 541. When's the next train? Not for a while. Uh, you, you come in there. Well, we could probably do with two of you there. Two? I thought we already had two. Oh, wow, we've only got one. Oh, well, we definitely need another one of you then. Can someone drop off? I could I could ideally do with some money. We need some cash. Yep, we don't have enough of it. Thank you for, uh, for reminding me. Probably because I've just spent an absolutely extravagant amount of money on uh, on our other trains. On the upgrade for the line. Oh no, don't lose it. We don't want you to lose it. We need to earn it, please. You know, just just if you're sure. 
What's that? Oh, is that uh, another freight going the other way? What's this? Well, that's Nature's T following the freight. Right, well, do you know what? An upgrade may be necessary. Hmm. Oh, look at that 156 go. Look at him go. Oh, he loves it, doesn't he? What we could do... Oh, hang on now, this is extravagant. We could actually bypass the fast line altogether with the uh, with the freight stuff. We could do something with this tunnel. If you branch off in the tunnel, I think you can. Would that look completely ridiculous? Of course it would! Right, yeah, let's, uh, let's get you out there. Can we, can we bring you under? I'd like to bring you under. Oh, hang on. Yeah, I'm, it's because it's following the land. Right, there we go. Right, so if we bring you to there, we'll delete that end bit so we can, we can start. Hang on, where's, where's the end? Uh, curve you back under. And what this is going to mean is that we won't have to uh, go on that little 30 section. Look at that. Brilliant. I mean, we are literally just butchering Great Mudson now, aren't we? Absolutely butchering it. But it's cool. It's fine. There we go. So hopefully, that's happened without too much prompting. Nope, nobody wants to go down here because it's probably not faster. It's probably not faster, but... Right, hang on. Coal train. Yeah, fair coom. Add you in there. Mmm, go by there, please. Iron ore train. Yeah, by there, please. Lovely. Oh, hang on. No, it's the... It's the oh, hang on. Right, so the bricks train you don't need to. You're sorted. The food train, you go around there, you're not a problem. The stone train, yet yeah, you're working until, hang on, Pengreg Ed, that's that way. It's Little Astri, right, hang on, where's Tampool? Where is Tampool? You before or out? You're down there, are you? Ah, you are, right, okay. Yeah, it's a Little Astri, need you to go down there first. It all seems to work, the Penstow Regional, everything else works. Yes. Right, yeah, you're, you've obviously not had enough notice, have you, to, uh, to obey my instruction. But it'll mean that the freight can just cut underneath, come whizzing through here. That doesn't change the fact that now the freight's having to cross itself. Oh, you know what, we haven't got, we haven't got enough brain power to think about all that at the same time. But what we do need to be thinking about, while I remember, we need to get Chapel Coombe connected to the network. It's one of the only towns, apart from all the others. I don't know you are. Which town doesn't have... A, is there a town list? Can we say a town list? Uh, Fair Coombe, yep, you've still not got anything. That's a shame. Yeah, everyone else, apart from Chapel Coombe. I know Chapel Coombe has got buses. Chapel Coombe is connected. But everywhere else, except for Faircombe, has uh, a passenger network now. That's uh, that's a real shame, isn't it? So we need to get working on that, of course. Uh, now, I think kind of around here would be... Uh... Ah, but then we would have a big hill to go down. What about, uh, what about here? You're going up a big hill. A junction would look ridiculous there. You're going to start, right, hang on, how about something like that? And I know it's 30, you'll have to bear with, because we can bring it off straight away. Yeah. I mean, it's not ideal, I'm not going to lie, but on this, on this high-speed network. But it's what we're doing.
Right, now, hang on. Because what I want to happen... I'm going to come out about there. That looks brilliant. We'll go over this gorge. What can we have over the gorge? Something modern. You're not too modern. You're modern. Are you done in different colours? Yeah, grey it is. Grey it is. Okay, go straight under this mountain. And we're gonna uh, we're gonna just kind of weave our way down. Did we say Chapel Coombe was gonna go down to we did, we said Chapel Coombe was gonna go to Steel Coed. Oh there we go, hang on. Right, right, right. That doesn't change the fact that Faircombe's still not got a service. Oh dear me, what an absolute headache. Well, we've started now and I'm into it, so we're gonna have you going down here. We're gonna have two lines, obviously. Because this looks ace. There's, there's no beating about the bush here. This looks absolutely fantastic. Just running alongside uh, this gorge. You can go across there like that. What else can we have? We can have one of you. You look nice. Oh, one of you. You look even prettier. And what can you be? You could be a. Uh, you could be that. Oh no, you could not. There we go. We'll have two. Two of you. Yeah. Thank you very much. Also save in the corner there. Flipping heck! Don't time fly when you're enjoying yourself. No matter that flipping auto save that we've seen this episode. It does feel like it comes around more often, doesn't it? Because then we could go down via Pentraeth and into Naimuth. Oh, hang on. Pensto by Sea. Ooh, we could, we could have it going to Pensto. One of them could go around there and one of them could just absolutely floor it down there. And still co-ed, where are you? you're getting a line as well. All these little passenger lines that I've forgotten about. This middle section of the map's really been neglected in terms of our our, uh, our lines, hasn't it? Right, there we go. We'll, we'll bring you along. There we go, bring you around there. What about a bridge? Something a bit more modern. We'll go with the green. So you're going to ideally go up there, right? It's still coloured. So we're going to have you as as that for the time being. There we go. Oh, that doesn't look nice, does it? Right, get you on a bridge over there. Uh, you can be that. Lovely. We're not putting an awful lot of thought into these bridges, but it looks nice. All of them look good. I wouldn't use them if they didn't look good. Uh, you can be another little 30 section. And you can go around there. Uh, you are oh, lovely. What about you? you you're not going to bridge pillar collision me, are you? That would be terrible if you did. Right, hang on. So we'll, we'll just meet you. And we'll, we'll go for a bit of that. How's that looking? I mean, it's looking brilliant, I'm not going to lie. Do we viaduct? Yeah, do you know what? To hell with it, we'll viaduct. Oh, with lots of mini pointed darts. Oh, wow. I mean, this is the golden age of railway, isn't it? Class 322. Oh, a 180. Right. Oh, how much can a 180 carry? Because a 180 might be a replacement for the HST. Don't be silly, Joe. You can't replace the HST with 180. We're not Grand Central. But we could be. Ooh. What about some other ridiculous, like, sort of express service that we could have them running alongside? 
How much can you carry? 176. How much can a 180 carry, please? Because if you can carry 176 or more, that might be the HST meeting its fate. You can carry 104, Mr. Voyager, so you're not going to help us. Although I didn't realise we'd unlock the Voyager. 180. You can carry 125. We could have two 180s coupled together. That would be a 10 car, which would be probably alright on one of these platforms. I like the notion. Right, so we could we could just have like a, a tan pool to, to wherever service. This service, it won't fit on the platform. Ooh. I like the idea, I really do. Like maybe a Grange Manor. I don't think you'll fit there either, will you? Oh, you might fit five there. We could have like an express from Grange Manor. You know, just, just down here. For no reason, other than simply making use of the... We could have an express up to Tam Vale. No, we couldn't. That platform's way too short. You're just trying to find a reason to use the train now, aren't you? Hmm. Yeah, I'm not sure. Uh, I'd quite like to incorporate some, uh, some 180s onto this route somehow. If you have any ideas, please do let me know in the comments. You know I do read them. Uh, and uh, I often try and reply to them if I'm, uh, if I'm feeling particularly fruity. Right, hang on. So you need to follow this line up here, ideally. No, we don't. You need to go around there. Follow the land. Follow the land. Thank you. We're going to go up and over. That's where we're going. Keeping, uh, yeah, that's a bit steep, isn't it? Straight over the top. Can we get away with that tunneling? No, we can't. But it's fine, it's fine. The tunnel is okay because it's only a little tunnel at the top of the hill. Ooh, that's, uh, that's not good. Ooh, that's not good. Right, hang on, right. Let's, uh, let's try to snake you back down again, my old chum. We just avoid the field as well, I like that. go and bring you round there. Fantastic. Right, okay. Uh, Chapel Coombe. I reckon a direct line. Uh, yeah, direct line round there. Ooh. Bring you to there. I'm liking that because then Chapel Coombe can grow over the top of the uh, over the top of the railway. Yeah, see? Road over there. Brilliant. Yes. I like it. I like it a lot. Uh, so, you're going to go down there. I reckon an express. Uh, we're we're going to pop you up to 75, actually. Yeah, there we go. See, this is a yeah. There we go. Can we can we go up, please? Yeah, thank you. Now, what about that? That's uh, yeah. That's a bit. Mm, yeah, yeah. I'm not sure if I like that, you know. But it could go to there. It could go to there. Can we have uh, can we have some slightly bigger arches? Yeah, medium. That's good. That's good. Some uh, some sort of yeah, brilliant. Right. Okay. Get you uh, get you around there, please. Not quite decided what types of traction we're going to use on this line yet. 
Although, Penstow by Sea is a very well connected. Ah, hold on, an idea's forming in the, uh, in the old noggin. What can we do with you? Can we get you to come off here? We can, and we can keep you at 75. Namath, Pentraith, Chapel Coom. So you could actually provide a faster service from Great Mudton. I don't know what would be faster, to be honest with you. I don't know if it would be. Right, can you do 75 all the way around there? Yes, you can. And it's going to involve a tunnel. Right, so what we'll do instead of that is we'll 75... To there, there we go. Keep you at 75 around there, thank you. And then we'll connect you up. Lovely. So what we could actually do, in theory, it could have just found a use for the 180s. Because we could have this as 100. 125, oh, let's go for it. That's absolutely a hundred you up there. Can you stay 125 the whole way? Why are you not talking to me? There we go. 125. You can. Right, hang on. So you can do... Yeah, okay. Yeah, dead. Uh, sod it. 125 over this bridge. 60 into the station. And then, ooh, now this is going to look brilliant. Right, yep, it is. It is. The 180s are going to run down here. And then we're going to we're gonna 125 you as well. Yeah, can you stay at 125 the whole way? Because that would mean that the, the services will be able to get out of the way of the HSTs. Ah, you see what I'm getting at now? I don't know if you do see what I'm getting at or if I'm just sounding like a complete and utter madman. Come on, autosave. There we go. Yeah, can you can you stay at 125? If you, oh, it's doing it. Look. Right. I reckon we can keep that at 125 if we tried hard enough. I mean, it's completely and utterly daft, isn't it, really? You know, would this line be 125 in real life? Don't be silly. Of course it wouldn't. Little branch line. There we go. This isn't real life. Right, get you on there. What bridge did we have? Oh, we'll have to, we'll just delete you and start again. There we go. There we go, right. I think it was that one, wasn't it? Great, yeah, that's the one. That's the one. Yep, yeah, I know the condition of multiple vehicles is absolutely atrocious. I'm a terrible businessman. And then it will slow to 30, unfortunately, for the junction. But that, you know, that's just what it is. And then you'll be able to 125 yourself all the way across the map, then. Brilliant. Right, okay. What speed are you at? Just out of interest. 60? Flipping heck. Right, well, you're going you're gonna to receive an upgrade to 90. How do you feel about that? I mean, you seem perfectly happy about it. There we go. And then it'll all fall apart when you go off doing 60 and uh, you go off doing 75. Right. Yeah. Let's get it in. Where's it going to run to? That is the question. I reckon it can just terminate at Tampool. Do you reckon? Terminating station at Tampool? I don't see a problem with that at all. Uh, right. 25 we'll have you doing cross and we'll pop a signal in there 
Now, if we're having two lines, we need to make sure that that's adequately signalled. Pop another signal in there. We'll pop a signal in the middle of the viaduct. I know I don't tend to do that, but we will for this occasion. It's a special occasion, isn't it? And, uh, yeah, that is where we are going to leave it for today. I'm going to leave you waiting until the next episode for a bit of 180 action. Thank you so much for watching today, if you have enjoyed it. Whoa, what's happening with the frame rates? Absolutely dropped through the floor. Uh, if you have enjoyed today's episode, please do make sure that you click that like button. It's always appreciated. And if you haven't already, what's wrong with you if you haven't already? Make sure you subscribe to keep up with the series. Other than that, as I say, thank you so much for watching. And hopefully I shall see you next time. Cheerio. Goodbye for now.